wait until I give me some more instructions. A new school year, a new grade, and a new learning experience for students. They hear your accent, they know you're different, they want to know where you're from, they want to know about it. So Shanice Bonner tells them what it's like to live in her home country, Jamaica. They're excited to learn that there's something different from what they're used to. A few classrooms away at Denison Middle School. All you need to do is match the correct description and you have the choices here below. Olpiano Junior De La Bajan is teaching science and learning a few things himself. In, in the Philippines, in Vietnam and in China where I've taught, they're, they're, they're very, very much quiet. Here, the students are loud. They are among 70 overseas teachers Polk just hired for jobs the county couldn't fill otherwise. The search for talent is worldwide. Right now, Polk County has teachers from all over the globe. Nigeria, Uganda, Ukraine. Most are classroom veterans. They're content area experts. They're familiar um, with curriculum. So getting them on board and in, up with the speed of things, it does not take long and they contribute. Foreign teachers we spoke with say coming here is an adventure. We always like taking challenges on, so. But it's also a bit of a trade-off for many because like Della Bahan, they leave families behind. Even though if I'm uh, other side of the, of the world and I, I just love the Americans. And schools like Denison love the fact they now have teachers that so many other schools are still desperately looking to find. In Winter Haven, Ken Suarez, Fox 13 News.